My name is Lisa Life and I am the Deputy Head Pastoral down here at Bancroft Prep School. I uh, am not used to talking to the camera, I'm used to meeting you all face to face. Um, when I meet parents and children on open day, um, I can talk for hours, I can talk for ages and ages, but also the first thing I always say to people, um, one thing that they go away with is um, hopefully how much I love this school. Because one thing I say to everybody is I've worked here for 12 years now and there has never ever been a day where I have woken up and thought I don't want to go into school. Every day I wake up and I want to come into this place. I love it. I love teaching here. I love working with the children. I love working with my colleagues. I love working with the parents and I hope that my enthusiasm for this place it comes through uh, in a little video as much as it would do uh, if we were meeting each other face to face because I really do love Bancroft's prep school and uh, I, my job here is to make everybody love and enjoy it as much as I do. There are lots and lots of people who will talk about Bancroft's being an academic school, an unashamedly academic school, and it is. We are stuffed full to the brim of extremely bright children but we are also a very caring school. Pastoral care is at the very, very heart of what we do. And at the prep school, our class teachers, our form teachers, are at the very heart of that structure. When your children join as alphas, they will spend most of their time with their form teacher. Yes, we have specialist teachers for art and music and sport and so on, but the class teacher is at the very center of your child's experience here. For me, it is vital that we keep this relationship between form teacher, parent and child right at the very centre of everything that we do. And we have an open door policy as far as the email and all inquiries are concerned. Communication is the key. We want to hear from you. It helps us look after your children. As far as pastoral care is concerned, we believe in being very proactive rather than reactive. We have systems such as our AS tracking, effective social tracking that we use. We have a strong assembly programme. We have a strong personal development scheme of work. All these things, all these things help us to be very proactive about personal care. We're not just reacting when something goes wrong. We have a really full assembly programme. We have a really full personal development programme. We have times when we have lots of visitors coming into school to talk about all, a whole range of personal, social, health, education subjects. The children are bombarded with information about character building, about how to look after themselves, about safeguarding. We want them to be able to look after themselves. We want them to be able to talk to adults. And the children are very uh, aware of who they can come and talk to in and outside school. Uh, so we know that they know how to look after themselves as well as we know how to look after them. Our character values are built into and embedded into everything that we do. Uh, curiosity, resilience, excellence, integrity, balance, kindness. These are words that the children hear throughout the day, every day that they are here. They are built into their academic learning. They are built into everything that happens around the school in their extracurricular activities. Character education, as well as academic education, is so important to us. On top of all the hard academic work, the most important thing here is that we have brilliant fun. The school has a wonderful natural rhythm. We celebrate harvest. We have wonderful Christmas concerts. In February, in the winter, we go to Young Voices at the O2. We have charity days, which raise a huge amount of money for local charities, but where the children also have tremendous fun setting up a summer fete on the school grounds. Visitation day, our visitation concert is breathtaking. As I said, I love being here. I bounce into school every morning like an aged tigger, and I would love it if your children came and bounced alongside me.